On the outskirts of a mine site in the Pilbara, high school students from Karatha are helping with a valuable dig. But they're not looking for iron ore. Yeah. We like digging and that's how I got this uh, vertebrae of a wombat, big wombat, megafauna thing. The megafauna things they're digging are actually diprotodons, distant relatives of wombats and koalas that have been extinct for about 30,000 years. They were as big as three tons and as high as two metres tall. Um, and they were a, a herbivores roaming the land. Diprotodon bones were found here in the early 1990s, but more were discovered last year. We were amazed to see bones everywhere and at that point we knew that it's not just one isolated skeleton, we had a major discovery. The discovery is making a big contribution to the study of ancient Australia. And one of the things that we've been able to determine so far is that the type of ecosystem that we're dealing with here is like a mangrove type of community and that is an absolute unknown thing. These students are helping to remove these ancient remains because as more fossils become exposed by the elements, it's important to remove them as quickly as possible so they don't get damaged. The fossilised remains recovered from this site could eventually end up on display in the WA Museum. Being able to see actual fossils like in real life and digging them up is amazing. I'm holding something that's probably like 100,000 years old. That's weird, as, but uh, you know, it's cool. You can use brushes and that to clean it off when An outback adventure inspiring the next generation of budding paleontologists. Jasmine Chong, ABC News, Dibble Lake Creek.